Boy, a lot of history on this wall. Starts with Mr. Robert H. Smith and J. Fay Rogers, the, the founders of the original Appalachian Broadcasting. They're actually breaking ground with the building that we're standing in now that was built back in the early 70s. And even before that, we had uh, men like Ed Warren doing the weather back in the black and white days. Look at the size of those cameras compared to what they are today. And this is a mechanical teleprompter. You had to type that stuff in a paper roll and somebody wrote it. Merrill Moore with the company forever, the, the, uh, the face and the voice of uh, our station. Uh, the first logo that we ran, uh, pretty complicated. It depicted the, the Pentagon there, the five state area we covered, the crown there, the Tri-Cities, and yes, we were in Bristol, Virginia, Tennessee, the Twin Cities. As uh, we back on down the wall here a little bit, this gentleman running the camera here is the father of our current production manager, uh, Tony Venable. That's Howard Venable. I went to college with Howard. We are, we are pretty old. Howard retired from the television business uh, down in Florida at the Orlando station. A lot has happened in technology in the television business. I think one of the biggest things that happened to TV was satellite. And, uh, of course, we get all of our programming, NBC and so forth, off of a variety of satellites up on top of the building here. But uh, prior to that, that actually had to come in on cable. And uh, initially, the station uh, would uh, hop via microwave transmissions from mountain to mountain our network programming. And that frequently went out. Uh, one time we ran the movie about Alvin York for six and a half hours until they could get that repaired. Uh, of course, we're here. In Bristol, one of our big landmarks, the Speedway, the big sign, the birthplace of country music mural. And uh, these three guys with a voice in the uh, pictures of, uh, of our station, uh, Lee Nolan doing sports. Of course, that's Merrill Moore in the center. And Rick Mitchell uh, did the weather here for a number of years. And this old guy, back when he had a little bit of hair left and uh, was wearing glasses, so uh, a black and white shot. I, I've been here 43 uh, years, been doing the, the mornings for 20-some, and uh, uh, I've been really enjoying it. Uh, our logos have changed. Our look has changed over the years as far as television is concerned, but our mission remains the same. I mentioned all the satellite dishes up on the roof. We certainly have a bunch of them up there now. It looks like a mushroom farm up there, doesn't it? And uh, get into the modern day era there, Tara and me there on the air. And of course, uh, we've had a number of people over the years with us, including Ann Carter, who was with us for 20 some years, uh, doing all sorts of newscasts. There she is with Garrick. And uh, this is certainly a, an interesting little look at history for me anyway. And I hope it is for you as well as uh, we continue to look to the future and uh, we'll continue to be here right here on WCYB TV.